You know, I spend all my time in this laser lab and no one can even see the laser until you look in the infrared anyway. Hi, I'm Adam Friss and I'm a PhD student in the Mechanical Engineering Department at Colorado State University. I'm also the recipient of a NASA Space Technology Research Fellowship, which means that NASA felt my research has the potential to contribute to creating new space technologies to support current and future mission directorates. The fellowship covers my student expenses and also provides research support in the form of a collaborator at the Jet Propulsion Lab in Pasadena, California. Right now I'm working on a new laser-based plasma diagnostic technique for the measurement of plasma properties in electric propulsion thrusters. These thrusters are used in many applications from satellite station keeping to deep space exploration. Before a thruster can ever be deemed flight-worthy and used in space, it must undergo extensive ground-based testing in a vacuum facility. My diagnostic technique will provide a non-intrusive means to measure electron properties in these devices and provide data to help better inform future thruster designs. My lab is in the engineering department's powerhouse energy campus. This is a cutting edge collaborative space for all kinds of energy related engineering work. This optical table is used for the development of the instrument and is currently set up for measuring Rayleigh and Raman scattering from various gases. I'm in the process of upgrading several key pieces of equipment to enable plasma measurements. For example, I started with a low power 20 milliwatt laser source, which is about the amount of power you'd expect from a high end laser pointer. And I'm now using a 5.4 watt source that will be used to generate tens to hundreds of kilowatts worth of optical power for diagnostics. The next steps for me will be transferring my new technique to the Electric Propulsion Group's large vacuum test facility at the Jet Propulsion Lab to begin thruster diagnostics. I can't wait to see how all this comes together in the next few years. CSU's Mechanical Engineering Department helps me be part of an amazing future.